Hi, this is Todd. I want to review a couple of methods of raising butterfly caterpillars. One of the most traditional setups is simply to place larval food plant cuttings in bottled water, as you see here. Then you simply place the caterpillar on the, on the food plant cuttings. This method works great for a vast majority of butterflies where the caterpillars are content to stay on the plant. After creating what we call a plant and caterpillar bouquet, simply place the bouquet into a five or a six gallon bucket, as you see here, and then place the lid on to make sure the caterpillar doesn't escape. One thing that you want to remember in this setup is you always want to cut a hole out of the lid and secure butterfly knitting material so that the uh, caterpillar can breathe and that the uh, caterpillar frass does not end up uh, getting the caterpillar sick. But what do you do when you deal with butterflies like the Indra or Pipevine Swallowtail or several varieties of checker spots that insist on crawling off the plant to rest? And by the way, they usually do this to protect themselves against predators such as birds, airwings, and spiders. But what would you do to create a, uh, create a setup for that scenario? Here's a method that I've devised called the twin cup method. It's fairly simple. We have a lid on, uh, up on top with screen around it. This uh, cup is a 32 ounce squat tub with holes uh, drilled in the bottom to allow a plant to go through so that the plant goes into the water but the caterpillars do not. And then lastly we have the cup that holds the water. Okay, Here's the system right here. Uh, if we look down into the cup, we can see where the, where the caterpillar is. And I apologize that that is not focusing. The caterpillar is on the plant, and the plant is in the water. And the last step, simply, is to place the lid securely onto the setup. What that allows it to do is if the caterpillar crawls off the plant, he doesn't have far to go to find the plant again, making it much easier to crawl back on the plant. Again, this is one of several techniques uh, to address caterpillars that do not like to rest on the plant. Thanks.